Ten years ago here in Dunmeadow, Bob Knight said goodbye to thousands of students after he was fired by then University President Miles Brand. I caught up with some students to reflect on the legendary coach's legacy. I'm a legacy student here on campus, so Bob Knight actually came to campus when my father was a student here, and everyone was very excited. I think he still maintains a lot of esteem and respect from current students here who remember his legacy, bringing us all of the NCAA championships, his high graduation rate with all of his basketball players, and really focusing on academics, as well as a high standard for athletics. Um, I know when he left 10 years ago, there was big uproar here, and I think that students don't so much remember all of the controversy surrounding it, but just all of the esteem that he brought to the athletic program here. Everyone relates IU with basketball for one reason, because of Bobby Knight, won three national championships, amazing. He coached a great basketball team for so many years, and he just, but the way he did it was so like irrational, uh -huh. but I mean, I guess it just shows how harsh you have to be to have a good team. I'm a big basketball fan. I've been playing basketball since I was in uh, fifth grade, fifth, sixth grade. And uh, ever since I've been growing up, I've always heard of Bob Knight in college basketball. He's basically the father of college basketball. And Indiana being a college uh, basketball state, I mean, you can you feel the impact everywhere you go with Indiana basketball and how we, you know, bring in, try to bring in the best, the coaches in the country, you know, to make sure that we have that basketball tradition passed on and on down through the generations that come here. So Bob Knight's last and legacy is just basketball itself in terms of the, in the college realm. People will still be talking about Bob Knight at this university a uh, hundred years from now. I mean, I grew up in Indianapolis and of IU family, followed him all through his career. It's too bad that we can't get him back here. While it remains to be seen whether or not Bob Knight will ever return to the IU campus, it's clear that his legacy here still remains strong. From campus, I'm Cody Sherritt, IU Sportcom.